when we talk about climate change, we talk about weather changing over a large period of time, not just our day-to-day -day changes. In Scotland, we have the occasional sunny summer's day, but our climate is generally quite cool and mostly rainy. Climate change does not look the same across the planet. It can be rainy, it can mean hotter, drier summers, but it can also mean extreme weather like storms and floods. Now, Scotland's pretty well known for our weather changing really, really quickly, but climate change happens over hundreds, maybe even millions of years. Our problem right now is that we're seeing that change happen faster than ever before. This is because we're releasing more greenhouse gases into our atmosphere, things like carbon dioxide and methane. Now, on one hand, those greenhouse gases help to keep our planet warm. Without them, it would be too cold and life wouldn't be able to exist here. Too much of that, however, means that the heat gets trapped inside our atmosphere and it starts to heat the planet up, causing negative effects for our planet. So for example, the carbon dioxide in our atmosphere is slowly dissolving into our seas, making them more acidic, which causes problems for the plant and animal life that live there. The sea levels are also rising due to the melting of the polar ice caps, and the hottest 10 years on record have all happened since 2005. And these are only going to continue as our planet heats up. One of the biggest culprits for greenhouse gas emissions are us humans. We burn fossil fuels like coal, oil and gas. We cut down loads of trees and we also build huge farms for meat production. Because humans are the biggest polluters, it means that we have the most power to change it. We can move to renewable energy sources, we can plant more trees and we can produce less meat. So let's run over the facts one more time. Climate and weather are two different things, but climate change can cause more extreme weather. It's caused by greenhouse gases in our atmosphere, most of which were produced by humans. We're already seeing the effects of climate change, but we do have the time and the ability to stop it happening.